Waste is basically which is no longer useful to us and is, it has no benefit to us now. So we have either discarded it or we no longer want to use it. I don't need the vegetable peels, so I chuck that, that's waste. Um, I'm done with drinking my uh, juice, so the Tetra Pak I chuck away, that's waste. <laughs> Where does this waste go? It comes out of our homes, it comes out of our immediate surroundings. It's taken by the kabadiwala and then where? As long as it's gone into the dustbin, after that it's not our business. When we throw anything, it, it, it is out of our sight but not of the universe. It becomes a problem when it is not recycled or dumped properly. It is somewhere uh, degrading land and harming the environment. I think the way we are living now, uh, we don't uh, think about the consequences of uh, the waste which is thrown away. Like we are seeing the consequences of global warming or rise in sea level or melting of polar ice cap. It's because we are not caring for our environment. The landfills have turned into land hills. We live in an environment so there's a need to protect it for a sustainable livelihood. Air is getting polluted, water is getting polluted. If we don't protect our environment then how will we live? The survival of humankind and the earth will be questioned. Phase 1 of the project started in June 2009 with 60 schools in Delhi and Bangalore. The basic idea of Project Surge is to uh, talk about and draw linkage between our consumption pattern and the waste that we see around us. I believe Project Surge is one of the biggest projects that has helped in the sensitization and education of waste management among schools and communities. We bring out students from their classrooms, give them an experiential learning and involve them in various series of workshop, competitions, simulation exercise and film screening. First we have to cut, then we have to clean it and then we have to dispose it off. Part of Project Search is uh, the awareness generating activities that we conduct. But a very, very important part is the constant waste collection that happens as part of the project. Biggest strength of Project Search is the we knew how to recycle and re reuse the waste again. And that is Tetra Packs and plus other waste also. I didn't knew that Tetra Packs can also be recycled in such an easy way. And not only Tetra Packs, we just recycle other things. 
because the tetra packs as we would cannot recycle it used to go into the blue dustbin some of them they would throw in green dustbin not aware of it what can could be done now we have, we know it where it can be thrown came to know that recycled products are equally beneficial like the new products it also saves our economic resources it was wonderful seeing how uh, something you throw uh, you think is useless and you just chuck it away is of so much use as a part of project search there are 12 ambassadors Six are selected from Delhi and six were selected from Bangalore. The idea being that these 12 students could act as role models and inspire their friends and parents and families. The ambassadors from Delhi were uh, taken to Wapi, uh, the recycling plant, and six from Bangalore were taken to Takwe, Pune. Project search and the trip to Wapi has made me realize the importance of the words environmental citizenship. Model of Tetra Pak recycling that was used in Wapi was completely sustainable. The purpose of these visits uh, are to help the Tetra Pak ambassadors understand that there is a great possibility that exists with waste and what can be done with waste. It's also about uh, telling them that if we want a sustainable future, if we want a cleaner and greener habitat, we need to do something today as individuals. A waste management starts at home. If we segregate our own waste, It'll, it'll be much easier to manage waste that way. If we are responsible citizens of a country, this does not mean that we should not be responsible citizens of the whole world. We are the ones who need to take some action, observe it, reflect upon it, and analyze it to do something. We are the ones who need to take action. I'm Virat Segal. I'm studying in class 12 at the Sriram School of Ravli. I'm a Tetra Pak ambassador. My name is Shivalik Chub. I study in Silvan Public School, class 10th, and I'm a Tetra Pak ambassador. I'm Richa from Chunji Bharti School, Shashant Lok. I'm studying in class 10th, and I'm a Tetra Pak ambassador. I'm Rudul Kataria of Bluebird School International, Kailash Colony. I'm in 9th standard, and I'm a Tetra Pak ambassador. I'm Adya Chavla. I'm in 10th standard in Springdale School, Pusa, and I'm a Tetra Pak ambassador. <laughs>